Hey guys, welcome to another plugin tutorial and today it's on Arena Plunger. So this is a really awesome minigame where players fight for the control of the Arena Plunger which will spawn in the middle of your arena or wherever you set it. There's a really nice particle effect around it which you can also change, I'll show you how to do that. And it's a really awesome minigame. So you can also change in the config what players spawn with when they uh, first go in. So if we do AP for start, that will... Um, make the arena start in five seconds so um, as you can see in the middle here the plunger has spawned so if we grab this we will get a very nice um, effect around us and we can also drop it and obviously you've got to get it to win and if you kill the other players uh, you will win the game which is uh, really cool and then you can get rewarded uh, depending whether you win or lose so, I'm going to show you how to create it and edit bits and bobs because there is some more commands than uh, usual. So first of all, what we are going to do is choose a new plunger for our arena. By default, it's a torch, but you can obviously change it. So maybe a blaze rod. Um, that'll do fine, so we'll do that in a second. So if you do the command AP create, and then the name of the arena, which is going to be YT, and then we can start adding spawns. So if we do AP alter YT one, that sets the first spawn. Two, that sets the second spawn. And obviously you could go on three, four, five, depending on how many spawns you wanted. And then we need to go to our plunger spawn, do AP set plunger, and then the arena name, test. There we go. So that's all you really need to do for an arena, but you can obviously change bits and bobs uh, in the config. You can also do that in game, so let's do that now. So set material, and this is going to be for um, the plunger. So hit enter, and that will change it to a blaze rod. And uh, as I mentioned earlier, you can also change the particle effect by doing AP set, um, what is it, effect, then the particle name. So I'm going to choose angry villager. I'll leave a link to uh, all of these. There's a lot of them. And then we need to choose the particle count, which is going to be 10 like that. And finally, the timer, which is how long um, the plunger can be on the ground before it's teleported back to um, back to its spawn originally. And I mean, obviously we can do set score to win, as with the other mini game I set a few days ago. Um, it's going to be five. Oop, set score to, to win. There we go. That's how you do it. And um, Finally, the sign, which is AP on the first line, join on the second, and the arena name on the third. And that will make a join sign. So let's go ahead and join the arena and do AP for start. And let's look at our lovely changes that we've made. And the compass we get should always uh, point to the person who has uh, the plunger. And as you can see, here it is. It's got this awesome villager angry effect on it. And uh, yeah, here we are in the arena plunger folder and you can see there is these four YML files. So let's go into the messages one to begin with. It's pretty small and obviously you could change the uh, text and maybe add a prefix if you wanted to with color codes. But um, I'm gonna close that and go into the next one. Uh, so let's go into the main config, which um, has quite a few different things. So um, match time in seconds. So 10 minutes long, that's that's probably a bit too long. I'd set it to maybe 120 for two minutes. Um, update interval, you can change that. Um, number of teams, so by default it's true. Uh, two, not true. Um, four maybe, depending on how many players you have. And down here is a very awesome option. So uh, you can change the health that players spawn with. Um, 20 is obviously the max and you can do 1 to 10 half health and obviously here you can add items so make sure you write them in the correct format so <clears throat> for example if you wanted to give them uh, iron ingot you would use an underscore not sure why you give them an ingot but there you go you could um, and there's lots of other things like uh, bow, bow is very straightforward because all you need to do is bow and then one. You could also do arrows as well. That would be useful if you had a bow. Uh, so let's go to the end and change this to arrow. 
and then 64 or something. And down here is what you win when you um, win the game. So you can change this if you want. And maybe give them zero money, depending on your server. You can even give the loser something, but um, <clears throat> not sure you'd want to do that. Uh, you, could, you could even give them like five hunger or something funny, like that. Potato. Like that. Pretty straightforward. So, um, yeah, you could also change the prefix here. Instead of arena plunger, um, arena, just arena or something like that, depending on what you wanted. Uh, down here is a list of the arenas. I wouldn't mess with this. If I were you, you can just change it in game. Unless you wanted to delete one, then you could just select it all, delete, and then you've only got one more arena left. And the config file um, is what we set in game. So if you wanted to change the type of particle, you could change it here. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So um, subscribe, like, comment, and I'll see you in the next video. Possibly tomorrow.